Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I want to talk to you about a skincare non-negotiable. This is something that you should be wearing 365 days a year, rain, hail or shine. It's super important and it is sunscreen. Protecting your skin against the harsh UV rays of the sun is so important to protect your skin against skin cancer, aging, sunspots. There's a plethora of things that it's gonna protect your skin against, but it's alarming how many people still do not incorporate a sunscreen into their skincare routine. Here in Australia, the sun is harsh. We're already just stepping into spring and these days already feel like summer. I'm gonna put a lot of that back onto climate change and things happening in the environment, but regardless, it's important that our skin is protected. I've personally had family members who have had skin cancers and melanomas cut out of their skin. And as someone with very fair skin myself, I know that I can't step outside for more than five minutes before going red. And I have a lot of freckles and moles on my body, so I know that I need to be protecting them. And, you know, not only with sunscreen, but also with coverage, with shirts, caps, sunglasses, you name it. So one thing that, like I said, is alarming is so many people don't wear sunscreen as part of their daily routine. And I don't just mean on their face, I mean head to toe. A couple of years ago, I went for a skin check and thankfully my skin was fine. I was very lucky, but he did ask, he goes, how often do you put sunscreen on your legs? And I never put sunscreen on my legs because I was always under the impression I'm like oh no I want my legs to be tan and so I just would never put sunscreen on them but he's like you need to be applying it everywhere and I know this sounds like common sense now and of course the penny dropped when he mentioned it but I was like wow I've really been exposing a you know a part of my body to sun damage and potentially getting skin cancers so the reason that I'm creating this video not to lecture you but I want to introduce you to a new Australian sunscreen brand, which I am so obsessed with. I've recently started using it. I discovered it on Instagram and there's just something about this formulation that hits so much better than all the other ones I've used in the past. And that is a brand called Naked Sundays. Now, surprisingly enough, this brand is developed in Australia also because the founders witnessed two friends have to get skin cancers cut out of their face. And after doing a poll, they realized that over 70% of people are not applying sunscreen as part of their daily routine because they don't like the, the formulation, it's got the white cast, it's too sticky, all the regular things that I know we've all experienced. So they decided to do things differently and that's why I have fallen in love with this formulation. So in today's video, I'm gonna share with you both of these products which have become daily staples and exactly why I love them. So the first product I'm gonna share is their Collagen Glow 100% Mineral Sunscreen. Now this has an SPF of 50 plus, so you're getting that high protection and it's 80 minutes water resistant. The other thing I love about this sunscreen is that it's multi-use, which means I can use it as a primer before I apply my makeup. I've done this with a few makeup looks so far. I've had no white cast. It's not a, um, it's not a made my foundation separate and it has given me that protection I need against the sun. So this sunscreen is water resistant. It's vegan friendly, reef safe, and it's made with plant-based collagen and antioxidants. It's also infused with watermelon extract. So I personally find that not only is it protecting my skin, but it's also hydrating it as well. It doesn't feel like a typical sunscreen. There's kind of no grit to it. There's no like oiliness to it. It's a really great formula. You can also buy a brush to apply this, but I purchased it solo and I just use my fingers. Now, I wanna do a bit of a comparison test and I wanna show you, I guess, just a general sunscreen formula compared to this one. And that's gonna really show the difference of why it's, I guess, why it's a standout for me and why I really enjoy it as part of my routine. Now, the first thing I noticed with this formula is it's much thicker than what I'm used to. At first I was like, oh gosh, is this gonna blend? But when I show you, 
you'll understand. So I'm going to apply this to my hand now, just so you can see the formulation and how it is different to a normal sunscreen. As you can see, it is a thicker formula, but it blends out so beautifully. Now I'm going to apply another sunscreen next to it. I'm not going to share the name. This isn't about me putting down any other brands because each are great in their own way, but I've just personally found this works better for me. Just to show you the difference. Okay, so here we have a competitor sunscreen, which is your normal white sunscreen. And as you can see this, it's almost got a subtle tint to it. So it's more, it's mimicking more of your natural skin tone rather than this white bright formula. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to apply this to half of my face just so you can see how it applies. As I mentioned, I'll be using my fingers and that way you can see exactly what it looks like and how it also kind of knocks back a bit of my redness that I get through my cheeks too because it does have that subtle tint even though it's not designed as a tinted primer. The formula literally just melts in my hand as I press it in and massage it into the skin. Don't forget your ears, they're important too. So while it's important to apply this, obviously at the start of the day, if you're not going outside straight away, be sure to apply it again 20 minutes before you go outside. So no sunscreen, sunscreen. Like I said, it's not tinted, but it does provide a subtle layer of coverage, which I do like. So I'm going to do the rest of my face now. So that is the Collagen Glow 100% Mineral Sunscreen. It's not tacky. It's not sticky. There's no white cast. It's an incredible formulation, which I absolutely love using as part of my daily routine. The good part is this retails for $39.95, which I think is a really affordable investment when it comes to protecting your skin on the daily. The next product in their range that I'm loving is the Glow Body Mist Sunscreen Spray. Again, this has an SPF of 50 plus and it is infused with vitamin C rich Kakadu Plum. It's a really beautiful, non-sticky, non-white cast formula, which is so easy to apply. The other thing I love about this is that it isn't in an aerosol can. I've used other sunscreens which are in an aerosol can and I'm really trying to move away from that because a lot of the aluminium ends up getting into your skin and it isn't really that great for you. So this has a really easy pump action and the spray itself is a really beautiful fine mist. It's so easy to use. Again, it's not sticky. It doesn't have an overpowering smell and you simply do six to seven strokes on each part of your body to give it maximum protection. Just like the facial sunscreen, they advise that you apply 20 minutes before you're about to go back out into the sun. But apart from that, you literally just spray it on and you're good to go. So those two have definitely become my skincare staples, especially if I'm going out on the beach. They're easy to chuck into my bag and reapply while I'm there. And it also just gives my skin a nice healthy glow as well. There's no mica or pigment in it, so it's not glittery or shimmery, but it's just a beautiful, healthy, glowing complexion. So you've seen the mist just in action as one shot, but I'm going to apply some to my arm just so you can see. So if I just do it over and so, I can barely even feel it already. It's not oily. There's no residue. It just applies it really nicely to the skin. It doesn't even have that impact where if you go out onto the beach, 
and then immediately you're gonna have sand stuck all over where you've put sunscreen. That's how quickly it dries and absorbs. And if you do have tattoos like me, it's super important that you keep those protected. Not only will it help with the color fastness, but you don't want your beautiful artwork that you've invested hundreds and thousands of dollars in to be impacted because you need to get skin cancers cut out of your body. It's not worth it. So that wraps up my Naked Sundays review and demonstration. I hope you guys have enjoyed it and it has given you some food for thought about how you can protect your skin all year round. Naked Sundays is an Australian brand. It's vegan, it's cruelty free, and it's free of parabens. So you're not putting any nasties into your skin and it's available now on their website. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you have any questions about Naked Sundays or sunscreen in general, just let me know in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, please hit the subscribe button and give it a thumbs up. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.